Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Jazz from the Six Figure Formulator. And today we're gonna talk about making PNGs. So what is that, first of all? What is a PNG? A PNG is basically whenever you see those pictures on websites, kind of like mine, for example, um, to where the product is floating and it doesn't appear to have any sort of background. We're gonna do that today. I'm gonna show you how to take a picture that's perfect to make into a PNG. This is the product I'm gonna be using today. This is my luxury face oil. As you can see, it has those gold flakes, those roses that are just amazing for the skin. Now, I'm gonna show you here in this video how to take a simple picture just with your camera phone so that you, can, you don't feel like you need a camera to do this. You can just do this simply with whatever phone or camera you have access to. If you do have a camera, even better. But I'm going to show you how to do this with some simple sunlight, your camera phone, and just a couple of papers. And once you have this picture, I actually have a video tutorial right now that's just $5 on the website that shows you how to create, take a PNG like this and create some amazing product photography and just overall good content PNGs and um, graphics for your, your business. You can see how important that's going to be whenever you want to just create content in general for your business to advertise and really get it out there. I'm gonna show you how to do this simply, this part, so you can go purchase that video and start take, making some bomb content. So that way, if your photography skills aren't all the way up to par, that's okay. You can still have great looking content for your brand. So let's go ahead and jump right in. Okay, so here we are outside on my little photography setup here. I also do teach product photography as well. I have a live class that's getting ready to come up. If you want to enroll, I highly suggest doing that. But if you're just here for this little freebie, that's fine too. Let's get into it. So what I did there is these are two stock card papers that I got from Michaels. They're very, very cheap. Like, well, when I say cheap, I mean inexpensive. They cost about, I want to say anywhere between 69 cents to just under $2, depending on what kind of paper you get and if it has any sort of uh, texture or anything like that to it. Um, and basically, you just use it as a background. It's really that simple. And I have a chair set up out here so that we could take the picture. I'm shaking up the product really well because sometimes the ingredients settle and that's okay. But what you're going to do is you're going to want to bring it forward a little bit. I'm sitting under the sun in direct sunlight and you want to have it forward so that it can cut out easier when you use your Canva app to do this. And so that makes that means don't have a background where your product is going to easily blend into it and to where the colors may show up. Like if I was using a blue piece of paper, it might be blue and that part and that part canva can't get out just make sure everything is clear in the background you have light colored and if you are using a lighter product i highly suggest using like a black paper or something that's going to be easy to where you create a clean outline for the canva to cut the picture i'm going to give it a quick shake i'm going to take some pictures here right on my camera phone and then you guys will see the end result of how this comes out little angling tip here you guys can see I'm taking some pretty straightforward shots I hope you like this video and make sure you get that canva tutorial of mine to show you exactly how I turn this into the picture that you're getting ready to see next and let me know if you have any questions all right bye guys